Hi everyone, this is Phoebe. Um, I'm here to show you my new projects. And before that, I want to thank you for all your support and uh, prayers for my husband. He was able to go back to work uh, since the surgery on this uh, first day, and he is doing well. We had a follow-up check yesterday, and so far, uh, there are good news that uh, he can stop the calcium that he has been taking and uh, uh, further treatment will be planned after January uh, 2016. So um, this is uh, what I have been making uh, since he was always home so I didn't get a lot of time to craft but um, he is uh, a project. Um, I have this beautiful round box from the uh, Gap Tree and the Aveline and I like it very much. It has some uh, lavender prints on the box so I just leave it there and then um, uh, the lid it was um, a bit uh, crashed since this is really old so I altered the front. Um, with basically a uh, wedding appliques so um, I have been searching for this heavy bead uh, wedding appliques ever since uh, the uh, last a couple of months but um, even though I searched like a crazy chicken all over the shop in Japan but I couldn't find any so I just thought I should make my own I just have this plain uh, wedding appliques and then I bought a lot of sea queens and bees and wingstone and then add them up everywhere as I like just like this and here and here so this is not as difficult as I thought and this uh, turned out really gorgeous and uh, you can make it any way you like and sea queen like this here and this is an appliqué, wedding appliqué from Olivia this one is a gorgeous DIY uh, 3D flower from the Shamelicious um, I regret that I didn't get more when it was available and I hope uh, she will reopen her shop sometime later this is really gorgeous and then I have a lady in purple here and um, I since the box is about lavender so I stuff some well dried lavender which I have from the church inside a wedding apple case and then just stick it up here it smells really good this one is from Olivia too and this is uh, cut up from uh, big pieces of bead uh, case and it is elegant you just need to find out this uh, sewing uh, line and then carefully cut them up and then use any part at you as you like uh, so uh, this is the front of the lead and on the ground I have this gorgeous uh, trim uh, to add it up all around the box and with sea queens here and then also add up some pepper pearl and wingstone here and then at the connect point con connect point of the trim I add to this beautiful flower wool set and to cover up the connect line so this is the lead let me show you what is inside So uh, first I have a uh, dry uh, lavender, uh, very nice, very elegant, smells wonderful. And then I have a, uh, uh, yes, you can avoid it, the lavender, lavender will drop out. And this is a sachet, uh, I dye, this is my first attempt to dye a purple color so the color turned out a bit too light and then uh, put in some dry lavender here 
uh, with wedding appliques and this is very simple to make just stick them all together and then on the back uh, one more this wedding appliques and this look um, really easy to make and this is elegant and then I make a pocket book um, I really like something that is functional uh, I not necessary to uh, carry out them every day in my bag but I would like to think that sometime I can use them uh, when I like it so uh, I beat them up with a purple color wing stone and uh, on this uh, rose shaped upper case and then um, this oh, I didn't say this one uh, this beautiful uh, trim uh, with purple color dye and then I, I decorate the hairdress of the lady uh, with simple trim here and then again on this flower and then um, I made a, a lead uh, open point here on the back with a snap snap button yes so when it opens it is like this uh, I made a small pocket and then chain it up with a chain here hook into here and this is a small button here I can open up this is simply uh, just stick up uh, to a long pieces of upper case and then you can put cards inside or small nooks here. This is a bit tight, I may need to address it. And then um, I made the pocket here with this uh, cut work uh, lace uh, to put in some cards here and then on the left side uh, I have made a small tag here uh, with another pieces of cut work and this wedding every case is for mommy and then also I can put some small cut here so this is the inside and on the back I also make a small uh, open uh, pocket here and inside there is a small butterfly fairy Uh, she has her butterfly wings and then uh, she is uh, with purple color and wingstone and I so far I just make it like this maybe I will add a clip or a pouch uh, on the back but uh, so far she just stay in the back pocket like a book furry so um, this is really cute she pops up like this sometime <laughs> and then this is uh, what I've made with the box I hope you all like it thank you for watching bye bye